Hi, Daryl B500 here. Doing my little contribution for the 10 things you don't know about me. Thanks to Spammy Guy 712 Probably not the first time it's ever been done, but hey, that's all I know about it. So you deal with what you got, okay? Speaking of which, I don't have a video camera, so you're going to have to deal with that. Just put up a few pictures of me making silly faces and a few other things and try and make this not be the most boring slideshow ever. Although I've got a video of it up. One thing y'all probably don't know about me is that I'm a songwriter. So in case you haven't already, you might want to check out who is Daryl B2, the lyrics. So I can give you a little insight of some of the things I've done. And another thing that y'all probably don't know about me, I come from a mentally ill family. Although it's one of the things about uh, go under the file of things that you don't know about me, but uh, more like things about, oh, well, I'm not surprised. So, uh, well, move on to the next thing. I, I could wiggle my ears. That's something else that won't come up since I don't have a video camera. So going on to the next one, obviously with a lot of my videos, I'm a gamer. But believe it or not, I actually do not have any current gaming consoles. At the time that this video is being made, it's not like I, I'm like, ooh, I've got a Nintendo Wii and you don't. Nah. Or it's like, hey, you know, Microsoft, Microsoft fanboys versus the PS3 people. It's like, hey, forget it. Screw you guys. I got both. Nope. None of that. The most current gaming rig I have is a 30, Sega 32X. They quit making that about 10 years ago. Not that it would be anything current, but probably in 2008 sometime I'll be getting a Game Boy Advance and a PlayStation 2. Might as well on the latter. It's compatible with PS1 games and PlayStation 3 is too expensive. I'm not really interested in it. Like I said, nothing current, but hey, at least it'll, it'll, be, a, it'll be consoles that were made within the last decade anyway. I'm an admin on a friend's website. The address is there. I don't have a current screenshot to come out uh, to, to put up. It's currently down. Should be up in the next week, though. Didn't even ask. To just put me up as a put me up as one. But haven't been too bad. I've gotten a few emails from weirdos I mean, <laughs> for a video game website. People have been sending me stuff about conspiracies about. <laughs> forget it. I'm not even going to go into that stuff. But it hasn't been a problem. I mean, Though he didn't ask, he was just kind of scraping the oh, bottom of the barrel. Oh, I think I'll make Daryl an admin. <laughs> no, just kidding. He doesn't do. He doesn't imbibe that kind of stuff usually. Anyway, getting the video game stuff out of the out of the way. I think you probably don't know about me. I'm a pretty big proponent of alternative medicine, Chinese herbs, and and acupuncture. It helped me out with a rare illness I have, and I'm not even going to get into. How many unprofessional doctors I had to deal with in trying to get this diagnosed. And more and more co insurance companies are starting to cover acupuncture treatments and also, you know, don't diss it. There are people out there who have been in horrible accidents, have horrible pain. They've literally gone to 30 doctors and they couldn't even get their pain dulled from very powerful drugs. And a lot of times acupuncture has helped them out. So don't knock until you've tried it. Another thing you probably don't know about me, I can solve an entire side of a Rubik's Cube. Yeah, there it is. I've kind of improved on myself from, boy, it's probably been over 20 years since I last touched one of these. Where at times I can actually solve two sides. I've got, I can't do it frequently. I've got a few ideas about how to make it work. This is, a, I picked this up for the first time in a very long time because my, my nephew had asked for it and gotten this on his birthday last month. I'm not too sure about looking at the, the clues in the little book and, on one hand, it's kind of like cheating, but on the other hand, it's like you don't actually think you solve the entire thing by yourself now, do you? So, eh, I don't know about that. Yeah, my sister's kid thinks that I'm absolutely amazing because I could just solve one side. It's like, well, don't expect me to be solving it blindfolded anytime soon. You don't actually think that commercial is real, do you? Oh, well, anyway. Another thing you might not know about me, I'm one of the rare native Houstonians. Most people come here, they don't get born here and then stay. I actually been lying out here for a decade, so hopefully in 2008 I'll finally move. I have three singles from these guys. I almost call them artists. It's like, no, if you're not rapping and singing, you're not an artist. I don't even want to say their name out loud. I think it'll bring me a wave of bad luck or something. Hey, at least I don't have the entire album, okay? Of course, this goes on a thing of not exactly things that you don't know about me, more like things I really should probably not be admitting. 
however you got a problem with that. Hey, I also listen to death metal. So, you know, you give me a problem with this. Hey, you try to listen to an entire song from Mythic. A bunch of equally wimpy girls. Yeah, that's right. You probably want to rewind this because you're going, did he say those were girls? Yep, even those demonic vocals. All females. I shouldn't say girls. It's not like females cannot play heavy stuff. But hey, people aren't used to that kind of thing. <laughs> I'm giving you a break. And you know, you really should not be listening to a clean thing here. You really should be listening to the, the CD, which is really badly produced. Granted, it's a demo to the point where it's buzzing at your speakers. Downloading it? Eh. No, you really need to hear how rough it really is. And then finally, aside from trying a cigarette once, and I used to smoke a cigar a year. I hadn't even done that in a long time. Other than that, I've never smoked. I don't even, not only have I never gotten drunk, I don't even drink regularly. I don't even have a you know beer after a hard day at the office. Never had unsafe sex. I don't even drink coffee. So I just thought I'd throw that out. Anyway, those are ten things that you probably didn't know about me. Probably didn't even care either, but what the hey. Make sure and come up with your own answer. Do what people come out with. Well, thanks for listening.